Welcome to Impact, bringing you global developments likely to affect Sri Lanka. Headlines Zambia debt restructuring at a standstill. US raises interest rates to combat inflation. China's domestic economy stunned by pandemic-led disruptions and real estate meltdown. Zambia's debt restructuring program is at a stalemate. The African nation, which received approval for a 1.3 billion US dollar financing facility from the IMF in August last year, has been unable to conclude a common restructuring framework under negotiations with its bilateral creditors. Impact on Sri Lanka Such demonstrates challenges in debt negotiations. While Sri Lanka secured financing assurances from bilateral partners, the issues faced now are in dealing with private sovereign bondholders. The island nation has to present a debt restructuring plan to the IMF, which may include domestic debt, by April of this year to receive subsequent fund tranches. The United States Federal Reserve raised interest rates by a quarter of a percentage. Such a small increase was to balance out inflation risks with instability in the banking sector and a potential credit crunch. The action also aimed at stemming a potential contagion to other parts of the world on the back of the troubled Credit Suisse being taken over by UBS. Reuters cited JP Morgan as saying that the banking crisis and rising interest rates means the US appears to be heading for a recession. Impact on Sri Lanka Gaining a clear picture of the consequences on Sri Lanka is challenging. However, any attempt to keep world markets from a potential downturn is welcomed, as Sri Lanka intends to export itself out of its current economic crisis. Vincent Clerk, head of AP Molomeisk, speaking to Financial Times, said that China's economic rebound is weaker than expected, as consumers emerge stunned from pandemic-led disruptions and a real estate meltdown in 2022. The world's second largest economy has set a growth target of 5% this year, its lowest in decades, as a result of President Xi Jinping's strict zero-COVID strategy. Impact on Sri Lanka While Sri Lanka's exports to China are low, the country is keenly anticipating a significant number of Chinese tourists. On average, a quarter of a million Chinese travellers visit each year, which dropped to less than 5,000 due to the COVID pandemic restrictions. A strained domestic economy will affect such travellers' desire and ability for overseas travel. And that's a wrap for this week. Subscribe to our YouTube channel to stay updated on the latest developments in Sri Lanka. Until next time, have a great day.